We're standing here with Michael Reeves, who is going to enlighten his group during his workshop on the business aspect of ballroom and hopefully give them some really good information because it is a competition and it's all about the dancing and everything, but it's a business as well. And it can be a very lucrative business, yes, but it, you're the man absolutely. with all the tips. Absolutely. Let me let you talk. <laughs> all right. You know, I think that the, I started a long time ago in this business with Arthur Murray's and then we went independent. And I think the thing that is really happening right now, which is really exciting, is that we have competitive business and we have social business. And if you combine those together, you will have a very successful school because you almost need both of them. If you just have a competitive school, it doesn't grow as fast. Or if you just have a social school, they the students will come over and over again yearly, but they don't see the beautiful part of the dance business, which is the competitive side. So by combining both of them together, you have what we call a hybrid school, and it's really, really exciting. What is one of the pet peeves that you see some of these instructors slash owners of their own studios do over and over again that could really cost them a lot of students? And money in the end, you know. I think that what happens is that they look at the competitive side so much that they ignore that you could have a social business which includes dances on the weekend and all kinds of group classes and you bring in independent teachers that teach salsa and Argentine tango and uh, mambo and all of these other um, types of dances that you really don't get unless you do a social business. So when everyone's out on the competitive circuit and they're doing what we're doing here, you have a social business going on which is still creating business in your school. So say for instance, uh, tonight and tomorrow night at our school in Silicon Valley, we will have 100, 150 social dancers tonight and tomorrow night, which pay for a group class and a dance, and that's lucrative income coming in while we're doing this. So both of them work together very well if you understand the method behind it and you use it effectively. And I think that's what's most exciting right now is collaborating both competitive and social dancing together. There you go, and that was all for free, just for you, right here at Desert <laughs> Classic. Thank you so much. You're welcome.